welcome to the season 4 success speaks of ccps so today we are having mr banu who have secured a placement uh, on campus so we will like to know about how was your experience and how are you feeling currently first of all thank you Utkash, for having me so coming to your question it was a great experience uh, the ccps is really uh, doing a good job in connecting the placement and bringing the companies so I would like to thank everyone first of all for giving me this golden opportunity, the on-campus placement. And coming to that, I'm feeling really uh, relaxed after getting a placement. And I think CCPS has uh, done a greater part in my journey. Okay. So I know that like uh, I would like to know how would are you feeling currently, and how was the feeling when you were preparing for the placement season yes uh, previously of course i was a bit tensed uh, i was just thinking like whether i would be getting a place in these time of uh, during these recession times but fortunately uh, i have given my best and somehow they liked me and of course uh, they were asking they were mainly focusing on the basics so i was really confident in my basics so that helped me crack the interview and of course i'm feeling good and relaxed a bit yes okay. previously i was tensed now i'm relaxed so could you please uh, let us know like for which position and in which company like okay. you were selected okay coming to the company i got placed in uh, fuji electric and i got placed as an electrical engineer for the r&d department and uh, yeah okay so how was your experience interview experience or the total placement experience was okay coming to the placement uh, procedure initially we had uh, we got to apply on the ccps portal after that we uh, we were given a test uh, and they were offering two roles uh, first one is the electrical engineer role and second one is the power electronics engin uh, design engineer role i applied for the electrical engineer role because uh, i am really confident about it and after that i have given the test uh, then they have shortlisted me and after the shortlisting they have taken an interview and in the interview mainly they have focused uh, on the work coursework that i have done and they mainly focused on the basics so i have basically revised everything once the placement once i got shortlisted for the interview i revised everything uh, from the beginning of my electrical coursework and fortunately he asked me what is your coursework i have just given him the points and the courses which i am confident about and he asked me a couple of questions and mainly he was testing the basics so yeah it was a great experience i would say and okay. yeah so Preparing uh, means the academics also help you very much for your placement. Yes, placement. yes, for uh, especially for the core department, the academics has uh, played an important role in my uh, placement journey because I was uh, most uh, more or less asked the questions from the academics section. I, I didn't prepare uh, much from the outside. All the things that I have done is I have prepared prepared all the things that I have studied in my labs and also my teachers. Okay, so have you done any internship that played a role in the placements i have did an in, uh, internship i wouldn't call an internship it's just uh, basically uh, i had to pay and they trained me in some uh, uh, some field of some fields and uh, yeah i have added it in my uh, in in my internship experience but that did not really play any important role and i would suggest students even if they, would, if they did not have any internships just know that and start focusing on your uh, placements okay so can you please uh, let me know what are your like future goals and what are you preparing for the future uh, yes i am preparing uh, in the core field only since i got a placement in future i would like to apply for the better companies like uh, in the core field there are bigger companies like nvidia and stuff so i would like to target once i, I would like to gain some expertise in fuji electric after that definitely i will look for better opportunities outside and yeah that is my future goal and what are the non-technical mm -hmm. questions that were asked to you during uh, nothing years? much no, nothing much so basically it started with uh, asking me to give an intro i have given them intro and uh, they started technical and at the end they asked me what uh, do you have any questions from i just asked them like i didn't have any much questions i just asked them like how was my interview and all he said you were lacking in some concepts but although the interview was good okay so are you appearing for the gate or preparing for the gate yes like? i have given gate 2024 it uh, went well and uh, if at all i maybe next year i'll give gate once again and i'll look through it okay so 
and what are the means like you have told academic uh, curriculum and also there are not non technical questions also other than that what are the area that the student should focus for the placement yes uh, coming to that i think aptitude plays an important role in a student's placement season because most of the uh, the very first filtering that comes that is basically the aptitude of course i didn't get aptitude as but most of the uh, companies that that are coming here they are testing the aptitude so i think a student should prepare uh, for aptitude as well in order to uh, move for the next rounds okay like anything you need to suggest to next batch for the placement yeah i would like to say to the other students just focus on your basics and don't get tensed eventually you'll get placed okay thank you so thank you for the talk for the students and congratulations once again thank you thank you thank you